Sunrise Mission in Bali has to be one of my favorite ways of creating the style of content I like to shoot. Waking up around 4 to 4.30 a.m., have a quick coffee at home, get all my stuff ready, and take on the bike ride. In dry season, these missions are quite mind-free, while in rainy season, things are definitely tricky. The heavy rainfall affects roads and obviously light too, so it's always difficult to find the right time to shoot. And this is why I try to shoot as much as I can during the dry months. Try to get some shots of this. Look at that smoke coming through. Looks incredible. Get the drone out. We try to fly the drone through there, a little smoke, and then also look around for nice rice fields to shoot. And the light comes up while we wait for Mr. Kevin. Kevin should be on the way. The drive usually takes one to one and a half hours to go to one specific location, while coming back afterwards with all the traffic, unfortunately it takes a lot longer. As the rice terraces were in the greenest, we decided to move on to a new spot, just a few minutes away to just fly the drone and get some shots there. And afterwards we headed into the nearby village, which looked incredible. Neither of us has never been here. So we try and get some local life and of course, find a coffee. Can I go into the village? Walk around a bit. And then the temple. Yeah, let's find some coffee. Coffee time, coffee time. Maybe walking down after that way? Yeah. That'd be cool. We go down way.
pagi. Apa kabar? Di dari uh, Italia dan Prancis. Dan Makluaga. Ya, jalan-jalan. <laughs> Ini kamu rumah? Ya. Ya, cantik. <laughs> There's not much going on. Should we maybe like walk like this? Yeah. Walk the main road and then go to the temple. Unfortunately, we weren't our luck today. This beautiful village was quite empty. We only saw a few people. And although we did manage to get a few nice frames and definitely some April drone shots just now, we decided to just move on to this new temple that Kevin wanted to check out just a few minutes away. You know, a lot of the times this is actually what happens. Exploring new areas just with the pure goal of saving spots for future missions. Beautiful temple. It's a long shop. Pagi pagi. Pagi. Apa kabar? Baik baik. Foto bisa? Bisa. Bagus. Satu lagi. Iya. Dari mana? Dari Italia. Italia. Iya. Buongiorno. Buongiorno, iya. Bagus. Oke ya. Grazie. Bagus, ya. Benar. Ya. Ini adalah zip line. Wow, that's cool. It would be so cool with the subject. It would be so cool with like local peoples here. Wow. Look, beautiful tourists there. <laughs> Selfie sticks and stuff. Even in the 2010. Look yeah, like it's, Indiana Jones. Though. Yeah, it looks very cool. Wow, look at this one. I was expecting it would be smaller. Look at this one. What is this? Is it a toilet? No, nothing. What is it? Toilet? No, nothing. <laughs> oh, what? Sky. That's crazy. I don't know. It's 
beautiful. Look at that waterfall down there. Let's see if I can get it. Get some shots of Kevin shooting. Exploring, exploring. Wow, long lens shot. I think I would do it on the way back. Yeah. I think it would be cool. Beautiful. I really want to come back on a day that there is like a temple ceremony. That would be epic. The fish is over here. That's a cool shot in between there. I think that would be a very cool shot. Do you want to like go around and like step in the middle there and just take a photo? There? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. so epic whenever I do make it back this is what goes on behind the scenes usually I don't really share this kind of footage but it's good to record here and then and just show you guys that sometimes I spend a whole morning to just pretty much get a handful of good shots and a lot of it goes down to luck Looks like it's all prepared for upper mango. Get here. Yeah, super quiet. Super cool actually this this setting here. Canon Autobot 2. Nice. Two more. Not all the time I get the best light, the best weather, 
the best frames that I imagine myself getting, but that's why I try and go shoot at least two to three times a week so that I increase my chances to get those amazing, beautiful cultural shots that I love. Thanks so much for sticking around and I'll see you guys in the next video.